Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to do yet another e.l.f. review on another product that I picked up during my big haul. The last product review that I did was on the e.l.f. Contour Kit Contour Palette. So if you guys want to see my thoughts about that product, click the link in the description bar. And then next we'll have the matte lip crayons. Not too new of a product, but definitely one that hasn't, all of the colors haven't hit stores yet. And so I decided, you know what, let me pick up all the colors that I cannot find in stores online. Today, however, I wanted to do a review and demo on the Mad for Matte eyeshadow palette. So they came out, I think, with three different eyeshadow palettes, and I definitely, I of course, picked the first one I decided to pick was the all neutral shade because I figured I could use this the most. This is only $10, and there's 10 eyeshadows. So I was like, okay, that's like a dollar in eyeshadow. So let's see how this product performs. The color quality, I love. I love the colors that they chose, especially you have this kind of like reddish tone brown shade. I think that's beautiful. I was like, this is definitely something I can wear for the work day, and I can even smoke it out like I did you know today for the evening time so color quality was great the price was great I do wish however um, maybe the pans were a little bit larger only the only brush that maybe I had trouble with not mixing with the other one is initially my fluffy brush you know when I kind of want to get into this it, it would have been nice to be a little bit bigger but you know what I can work with it but the rest of my brushes are tinier the little shader and my little pencil brushes I think that was fine the pigmentation of these shadows, I was very impressed with the pigmentations of these shadows. Um, I thought they weren't going to come off on my eyes as well. I did start off with an eyeshadow base as I do all of my shadows. If you're going to use an eyeshadow, definitely use an eyeshadow base. It's just going to help the eyeshadow stand out more as well as the longevity. So I, you know, that's something I'm going to do for every single shadow. If I would have just done them on their own, I definitely don't think it would be the same as, I don't think I would not you know not use an eyeshadow base so the pigmentation was really really nice you know as I swatched as well as as I placed on my eyes I didn't have to like build and build and build too much the blendability I was impressed yet another thing I was skeptical about but I was impressed with the blendability of this palette it wasn't very difficult it wasn't very chalky it blended out very very nicely now the only issue that I have about this palette that really kind of brings down my ratings for it is the longevity the wear time I feel as though these really don't last as long as they could as they should as say the other drugstore palettes do um, I wore this for the work day the first time and I saw it kind of fading away especially like this cocoa brown shade I saw maybe more of my crease color kind of staying there um, definitely the kind of beigey shade on my lid that starts to fade but I'm like you know what it's the end of the work day most of my makeup might end to, you know start to fade towards the end of the day so I didn't judge it too hard I was like okay let's try it again was it you know just because of the heat and everything or you know was it actually the eyeshadow palette the next time I kind of wore it I noticed that I had it on I put it on towards the end of the day to go out and this was only for like four or five hours max and I noticed the darker shades where I had kind of you know done more of the smokiness I noticed most of about 80 percent of the shades kind of faded so honestly longevity wear time it's not that great it'll last you maybe like three or four hours before it starts to fade which on that's a big kind of deal breaker for me <laughs> because I'm gonna wear eyeshadows especially whether I'm going out at night or I'm gonna use it for the whole day for the whole day I need it to last me at least like eight minimum to like about ten maybe 12 hours if I'm going out at night um, I'm kind of an old lady I like to leave early so please last me at least five hours <laughs> before I try to escape back home so overall if I had to rate this product between a 1 and a 10 honestly I feel like the fact that it does not last as long that the colors begin to fade I would probably have to give this a six at most a six and a half I don't think this is a product I would repurchase it's Everything but the fact that it doesn't last as long is really great. That is just a deal breaker for me. So, but if you're someone who just, you know, kind of wants to play with different colors, experiments, I think, yeah, then go ahead and buy it. But it's just not going to wear. The wear time isn't that great. And that just kind of brings a product down a little bit for me. Other than that, I was excited for it. So if you guys want to check out this product for only $10, or maybe you want to try out a cheaper product, another product, I'll probably go and look through some more Elf products I'm always looking for new drugstore items for you guys to check out but if you something you just want to play around with and experiment this is a cute little like stocking stuffer I feel like for like a preteen teenager who's just kind of 
well, teenager. Um, <laughs> hey, everybody's different with their age. You can start wearing makeup. But I would say, you know, teenager, 15, 16, <laughs> if I had a daughter, um, I would say, you know, if she wants to just kind of play around with makeup, I think this is a cute little idea for her to kind of experiment and play with. So if you want to do that, I think that's, that's the way I would use it. You know, I would gift it towards, you know, someone who's just learning and just trying to play with new colors and they don't want to spend it too much. So if you guys want to see how I got this look, really simple and easy, I think the color pigmentation, you know the payoff is really great and you guys want to you know if you do have this palette um, definitely check it out and see if you guys like it until then make sure to subscribe and keep up with some more videos and I'll see you after this video Thank you. 